Hello everyone, welcome back again. Today we are going to create a basic floor plan with uh, TrueCAD uh, software. First, in here I will create a line start from this point and I will active for auto mode. We can move to the bottom here. I will set into 4500. Next, uh, you can double click middle mouse to use uh, zoom extend. You can move to drag here 5000. To the top 4500 and type C press enter to close this line command you also can press F7 to hide code <coughs> the next I will use uh, copy command to copy this line object to the bottom here 1500 you also can copy this line object 1500 and the last we copy this object to the left here 2000 then uh, press enter now we can use uh, trim command, press uh, enter twice and we can select this line object to cut and also cut in here. You can use a join command to combine this object and also we will combine this uh, lines object. Now we can use uh, offset command with uh, offset this 10, 150. You can click uh, this line object, click inside. We offset again but with this 10, 75 this object click uh, inside or to the left and click to drag we also has to do some step for uh, this line object okay you can select um, the line and press delete button i will create line start from this point into here and now you can use the trim command press enter twice press a shift button hold you can select this line object to extend and then we cut this line object Okay, now in here I will create a rectangle, start from this point, move into here, copy this rectangle object from this point into here. Okay, the next uh, we can insert hatch into this uh, wall, so you can tap hatch, press enter. I will use the gradient and we can change uh, this color into here next also this color into this color you can click ok now you can choose uh, pick internal points and you can select uh, to this point you can select one by one press enter ok to apply you also can quadrant rectangle at this point ok again in here and the next at this point we use a hatch again, you can tap hatch, press enter, use the gradient and use a pick internal point, you can click at this point, one, two, three, and four, press enter, and OK to apply. Now uh, we can create a simple door, you can use a line command to create line from this point to the top, I will set into 900. You can create arch from a center point, click at this point, center point and move into here, move uh, to the left here. We can copy this line object to the left of TNG and I will create line start from this point into here. Move to drag here 40 and to the bottom 150 to the left of 40 and you can click at this point. Next you can copy this object. Okay, copy this object from this point, move into this point. We can create another door. Okay, in here we can set four lengths into 700 use a uh, arch command to create arch from center point point and move into here the next you can copy again 20 and then you can copy this uh, object from this point into here the next we copy this object from uh, this point into this point we can combine this all object and change into group. You can tap group, press enter. 
we set name in here into window 1000 sorry 900 select entities and you can select uh, this object the next so window 700 select entities and you can select this object you can press enter to apply okay next i will uh, rotate this object 90 degree and then we can move from this point into here we can use a uh, rotate command to rotate uh, this object sorry in here we can use a mirror command okay from this point to drag here and i will delete uh, this object we can use a move command to move uh, this object into here okay now we can use a trim command to cut uh, this line object and also a cut at this point press enter now in here uh, we delete first for this hatch and then we can apply new hatch you can tap hatch press enter you can set gradients and add big internal points okay you can select one by one again for internal points now you can press enter the next uh, i will create hatch again with uh, this pattern for color we can set into yellow scale 20 and use epic internal points so you can select in here one by one you can press enter again to apply okay now in here we can use mtext to create text so you can type mtext press enter again i will create text in here and we can set for Hack into 120. Now in here I will set the name into bedroom. You can click outset to apply. Then you can move from this point into here. Copy this uh, object to the bottom here and add this point. And also in here. Now we can change, double click, I will change into bathroom. In here we can set into kitchen. And in here we can set into living room. Okay. Now, uh, for finally, we can insert dimension into this floor plan. You can tap D to open Dimension Style Manager. And I will use a notative. You can click Start Current. Click OK. The next, you can click Modify. In here, I will set for lines. Dimension lines. In here, we can set into 2. Next, for color can set into another color I will set into this uh, color 30 also in here we can set into 30 now for text we can change text color into yellow okay this uh, for yellow or the other you can set to green the next for this time around text set into 2 you can click ok and close you can set for dimension in here i will set into 120 you can tap dim link to create a dimension linear click from this point into here and move to the bottom here so it will be small in here and then i will change again for dimension style we can edit we can set in here into middle okay set into middle for text and now for lines we can set into full text in here we can set into full click uh, ok and then we can close and we can set for scale into 150 we can use a dim link ok 
okay, from this point into this point click in here you can select uh, this uh, dimension and press delete button okay, I will move uh, this dimension into this point next you can create a dim dim again start from this point move into here okay and then in here I will use uh, M to point snap with between two point snap you can click out from this point and in here so it will be placed in uh, center point okay we correct again from this point into here use uh, m to p meet between two point okay the next from this point into here and then from uh, corner into corner point now in the left we can create dim link from this corner don't forget to use the mid between two point snap okay and then the last from this point into corner point sorry corner point and we can set from corner point into corner point okay now we already create uh, this uh, simple basic uh, floor plan with uh, TrueCAD uh, software and if you have any question about this uh, tutorial you can comment below this video.